17. Thanks so much, Kevin. And to hockey and to the Golden Knights trying to get their act together 3,000 miles away from Vegas. Peter DeBoer has now won and lost. Now we'll see if Coach can earn his keep. Ron Futrell is our Canadian correspondent. Well, hi, everybody. As a light snow falls here in downtown Montreal, the Knights can at least be happy that they left here with a point with that shootout loss from last night. It also marked the return of the former Montreal captain, Max Pacioretty, to the team he played for. Well, it was a fun game. More like to be on the other side of it. Um, shows a lot of character to come back, but dug a, just too big of a hole um, to, to win that weather and regulation uh, had some chances in overtime, but um, this is a lot about our group that we were able to battle back, um, but definitely have to clean up that start. Uh, we knew we had a lot of time to come back in the game, and uh, honestly we did, and uh, it was uh, at, the end of the, at the end of the season that's going to be a big point for us, and uh, uh, they played well as well. You know, it's a tough, tough building, it's a tough spot on the road. Uh, you know, we've got a, a number one, two centerman out of the lineup. I thought, I thought our guys battled hard. Uh, you know, it was one of those games where there was some seeing eye goals around the net that went in in the first, and you get games like that, and they can run away on you, but we didn't allow it to. We, we stuck with it. So from here, the Golden Knights go to Boston where they have a game on Tuesday, and then Carolina on Friday. So this long road trip continues for them. Finally, this upcoming weekend, they'll return home for the All-Star break. In Montreal, Ron Futrell reporting 8 News Now.